character that won uh, Smoke, right? Human Smoke. What was the character that won the one before that? I think Reptile. I think uh, uh, Cabal. All right, the one before that. Cabal. The one before that. Uh, either Human Smoke or Cabal. The last, the last like five or se six majors were Smoke and Cabal. Oh wait, no. I think you might have won one with Nightwolf. Oh yeah, yeah. But I'm just saying, like, okay, if you look at the game from a tournament standpoint, then I guess you could say the game is not that balanced. Two characters. No, but you see a much wider array of characters used throughout the tournament. Yeah, that's true. All right, so we're gonna let these guys go one more after this one, and then we're gonna get some new players in. I think the character to have won the most tournaments is probably Jackson and Cabal. In uh, in MK9. Yeah. Yeah, I would say. Because so. if you look at the West Coast, what's his name? Uh, Tyrant usually wins most of them. And then on the East Coast, CD Jr. wins most of them. Whatever happened to Michelangelo? Is he even still playing? Uh, I don't. I think he did play a local recently. I don't know if he plays the game hardcore as he used to, but. I mean, if you look at the picture, like. The best players on both coasts happen to be Jax players, which is pretty funny. That's funny. Yeah. Wow. I would like to see a Jax. Uh, a Jax face off between CD Jr. and Tyrant. I think that would be pretty hype. It's always fun to watch. Uh, it's always fun to watch Natus use uh, Shiva. He's not bad with her. Apparently, there's a rumor that Shiva has a wall infinite. Yeah, what? Well, Something close to a wall infinite. And isn't um, wasn't it? Uh, why can't I think of his name? Didn't Arian? Doesn't Arian know it? I have no idea. No doubt. I have no idea. I just know. I just saw this thread on TYN that says, "What is the wall infinite, or something?" I think it's a troll, but I don't know. <laughs> Hold on one second, guys. I'm gonna go get some info. You know, Shiva actually is pretty solid now. She has a pretty good firewall. You know, you don't you don't really have to duck her fireball. You could just uh, with some characters that lower their hitbox with a down three or down four. You could do that under the fireball and it'll whiff. I say Shiva is decent, close to good. She still does have some pretty big flaws, like huge hitbox. Her footies are kind of meh. Round one. Fight. She's too slow in a lot of her moves, but she's better than some characters out there. Like, if you had to choose between a character of either Jade or Shiva, I'm sure a lot of you would go with Shiva. They should make Shiva's forward 4 advantage on block and make it a pop-up if it hits you. And an overhead. If you want to make Shiva high tier. Okay, so I just spoke to uh, one of the owners here at uh, Gamer's Edge. And uh, so next week, um, next week will be um, one of our only non-Thursday nights at the Gamer's Edge. Next week, VSM will be on Wednesday night to avoid Thanksgiving. Okay, that's awesome. It's really great. So we're going to have to let everybody know. Bring a couple of bucks and we'll go out and get some food. Shiva wins. 
Everybody gets turkey sandwiches or something. <laughs> I hate turkey. Then how do you like Thanksgiving? I don't really do Thanksgiving. All right, fine. Shiva. Humbug to you, too. <laughs> hey, guys, last match. We're going to get another set of players on there soon. Well, Paulo, it's time to upgrade, dude. All right, the guys who are saying Scarlet's pressure is better than solid... And by solid, I would mean like Reptile has solid pressure. Have you guys actually tried playing the character in a high level setting? Like in a tournament? Scarlet looks really, really good on paper, but have you actually tried playing Scarlet in a real tournament setting? A lot of characters seem good on paper. Jade, Scarlet, Sundell. Night Nightwolf seems retarded on paper, but he's not that good on an actual game. Okay, so actually, I just spoke to Jonas, the owner of... Uh Gamer's Edge, and he says I have to call him next week and find out because he says that since the place isn't completely finished, um, we may have to wait until uh, we may have to wait until the week after to come back, just because he wa he was kind of hoping, you know, kind of counting on us not being here next week to finish up. So we'll see. I'm hoping he does say yellow. It would be nice. It'd be nice to get in here and not miss a week. Um, if not, you know, maybe what I'll do is I'll do a small house stream, bring you and like, you know, a couple other people over by me. Maybe we'll do it that way. Somehow or another, we'll get a stream going. And you've seen my office, you know. Yeah, yeah. There's if we, like if a we, bunch of TVs <laughs> in there. <laughs> if we stream from there, there's gonna be a ton going on. I just feel like the people who say Scarlet is is good, they need to actually play her. I really need to get some food. I think Scarlet was nerfed. I think Scarlet is the most is the character in MK that's been treated unfair, and I mean really unfair. You know why? Because look, Scarlet, when she came out, she was banned. Rain was being allowed, Freddy was being allowed. However, Scarlet was still banned. And then when Scarlet finally, you know, le uh, is becomes allowed in tournaments, she becomes nerfed like crazy. Like I mean, really nerfed. They nerfed the shit out of Scarlet. For no reason either. Scarlet was pretty, you know, solid back then. She wasn't retarded, broken, or anything. People just bitch for whatever reason. So I, I really think Scarlet's position right now wasn't justified at all. I think it was really unfair. So I, I think that there was a um, there was a request for you versus KT Smith on stream. I right, I'll play him. Let me go find him and get him over here. So how was your opinion about Scarlet? Like how she was, you know, the first DLC, but still wow. being banned. Pa Paulo pulling out the old the, the B lock um, character it was supposed to be an MK4. Whatever happened to that character? It was, she, uh, was supposed to be an MK4. I never understood what was he supposed to do. I don't know. I just know. And there was like a random picture of him out there somewhere too. The same way uh, Shiva <laughs> wins against Cabal right now. Okay, so our next match is going to be Rio versus KT Smith. And Rio, you want player two, so it'll actually be KT Smith versus Rio. And then we're going to have to get Revolver back on the stream. But however, look, the truth, even though you say that, 
you could look at it this way. How was an old Scarlet player ever going to win against a Kung Lao or a Smoke back then? So it, work, it works both ways. So what's going on there, uh, Dark Natus? Not much, guys. How's everything going? You getting going? yourself ready for? Uh, you getting yourself ready for NEC? No. Are you coming to NEC? No. Why not? Smoke. Priorities, man. Priorities in life. Got Christmas coming up soon, man. I gotta work. Uh, you're working no, that no. weekend? No, I work Sundays. All right. I'm a, yeah. Well, you can come down for Saturday and play on Saturday. Yeah, if me, you don't make top eight, you don't even have to stick around. You got to remember my priorities, you know, let's say, you know, I work, I got to work, got to pay bills, I got a son. And, oh, I didn't know and, you had a son. Yeah, I got a kid, I got How a 12 old? year old. Wow. Yeah, you know, and Mortal Kombat secondary to everything else, you know, you got to take care of life stuff. Did you start or, teaching him Mortal Kombat? You know, he tried playing a little bit, but. Um, he, he's, he's, just, he's a modern warfare kid, isn't he? He, he loves his Call of Duty. Uh, uh, I hate that game, that Call of Duty crack. Sorry, Liu Kang. We didn't get a chance to play uh, UMK3 last week. Miss, wait, who just asked for that? I'm 30 years old. I'll be 31 soon. All right, so this is going to be a good match here. Rio immediately get in there, yeah. starting up with those candles, and he gets the spin. Using an extra spin to go to build a little meter. Resets him on the ground. Looking immediately with that ground saw. What's up, guys? KT guys catches there. that uh, smoke bomb, but Rio breaks it. Hey, have you used the ball again? Yes. I thought this flavor was Sindel this time. No. Oh, all right. We're just getting patrolled over there. Nice hit. KT drops the uh, dr drops the combo, throws him into the corner though, and then catches the smoke bomb off of it. Now, I was playing KT before on the side, and I have to admit his his smoke is sick. And he finally yeah, he taught is. me how to how to hold down one thing works with the, with the smoke bomb, and I finally got a feel for it because remember last the other day that um, he CJ blew me up, and he takes the first round against uh, against Rio. Yeah. Rio's gonna have to step his game up a little here. Guys, blow this. Uh, and what do we got? 164 viewers so far. Yeah, guys, blow up this match. This is going to be. This is one of the best matches of the night so far. KT Smith Smoke versus VVV Rio's Cabal. He catches him off that smoke bomb. Rio has to break it. I thought I thought he'd be Here he goes. Now he doesn't have to have the, the meter to break it this time. One, two, three. Jump kick, air throw, teleport whiff, but he gets hit right. with the saw. Wow, he actually did a, Rio did a wake up saw on that. Nice shake. EX shake. And look at that. Oh, he used that right EX that. dash to get over and into him. Pops him up. He's got some damage to make up. Yeah, he doesn't really uh, have too much. Uh, we got the cancels. Here we go. And this oh, is going to be a it. punish. This could be it. Yeah, he got him. Pops him up and he takes a round. Now we got a 1 1 here. Tweet it out, guys. Tweet it out. Let everybody know about this matchup. This is a really good match. I gotta make the quality on this right there. It looks really good. Yeah, we're actually well. This is this is coming in a little differently than on the stream, but we're going at uh, we're going actually at 59 frames a second on the stream. Okay. Yeah, right here it looks sick. I'm like, wow. Huh. 
What's up, DJ? I see your message there. What's up, the rest of the guys who said what's up for me? This is zoning one. Oh, catches with the combo. Oh, blocked his dash. Now, I would think Smoke is a pretty good matchup for this because he kind of nullifies Cabal's um, anti air fireball game, so he can't really do much against it. Like, just exactly like right there, and he caught him. Oh, that was a good move he did. He didn't want him to use the breaker there. It was a good move. Just flung out the projectiles, man. Let's run that back. No, that's it. Looks good. I like the swords. The swords look hot, man. It does? Oh, it's real small. Yeah, you, I do see it there. That's kind of hot. Uh huh. And that's only 360 there. What are you streaming at? 480 right now? Only 360? Okay. Nice, caught him with the anti-air, the smoke bomb, and gets breaker for it. Chucks him over his face. Take two to the chest. Hadoukens him out the way. Take two. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Does he have any meter? Oh, he, he's got a breaker now. Oh, yeah, he dropped it there. He's trying to mix it. Wow, good mix. And he read yep. that. Wow, he really he really baited that. Wow, wait, Rio's playing on a controller, not a hitbox? Yep. What's the miracle here? Uh I, I actually has to do with the fact that he thinks that a hitbox is unfair. Get out of here. Yes, sir. So he's no longer gonna use a hitbox? Nope, he's back on controller. Wow. See, that's right. why he can't really zone out uh, uh, Smoke. He's got to get up on Smoke there. He can't just use instant air fireballs because uh, Smoke can do the shake. So is this going to be a trend now? People are not going to stop using the hitbox because of that? We may eventually, yeah, we may eventually ban the hitbox. We haven't yet, but we might. Wow. Air throw. And he's going to put himself in trouble there, but he has to break, and he does. Nice. Rio's not going to waste his meter right now. And with yeah, good you, good reason, <laughs> he had no need to. No need to waste it. I'll tell you right now. I'm calling it right now. I think KT Smith has a chance to go far in his pool at NEC. Really? It's his wow. smoke is that good. Yeah, it is. I have to do have to admit. I mean, it takes a little while to get used to, but it, it is definitely good. And even when I got used to it, I was still having trouble trying to beat him. Juggling there. Dash cancel, dash castle. Uh, Rio breaks there. And now he's going to see a punish, but he breaks. What's up with some UMK3, man? You going to put that in there now? Yeah, if we have the time. We didn't get to play in the tournament, man. What's up? We didn't get to play the tournament. Yeah. I, I entered into it for the first time ever. You'll, you'll get in on the next one. Uh, all right. I actually practiced for what with my roommate. He was bringing my skills back for a while. All right. I was like, wow, I was starting to remember stuff. <laughs> All this talk of UMK3. He's got storms going nuts. He wants to see some UMK3 tonight. <laughs> yeah, I was finally getting used to the run button again. I was like, oh, my God. <laughs> I gotta admit, we gotta get some KI again, man. That was really fun playing that KI. Storms, I'll call you uh, sometime during the week and we'll figure it out. You know, uh, uh, Paul, you know what they should allow in the MLB? Composite bats. 130 mile an hour ball exit speeds. 
And What's up, Summoning? Takes it again. Summoning wants us to play you on K3 also. Yeah, Summoning, we gotta play some KI again also, man. Oh, oh stop. I love my. I was having fun I with that KI, KI, man. It's been yo, years since I played. Yo, it was so loud, too, wasn't it? Yeah, it sounded nice. I know. It sounded so beautiful. KI is so much fun. I was really getting back into it. I was actually going on Game Facts trying to find out what the moves were again <laughs> and how to do the ultras. Like, oh, shit. <laughs> nah, Polo, the composite bats are. Uh, I'll tell you right now, composite bats are a thing of the. Uh, are, 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 that they're it. If you play softball, man, all you use is a, is a composite bat. It's all about the bats, especially composites. Yeah. What's up, the truth? You have a question? What's up with the player cam? We don't. I gotta get a new one. Uh, that was no good. No, the one I have, uh, it, it's not working well. Ah, oh, that sucks. Yes, Rio is dropping the hitbox. I know it's the first. We, instead of dropping a character, he's dropping a hitbox. He's picking up characters and dropping the hitbox. Yeah, 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 yeah. tell me about it. I never heard anybody drop a controller instead of a character. One, two, three. Catches that EX. Gets inside with the whiff uh, teleport. Yeah. Wow, the shake. She lands right in front of that shake. Unbelievable. Yeah, he's playing on pad right now. He's got a, what is it, PS2 or PS3 pad. There we go. The shake catches Cabal. And he spins him. KT breaks. Does Rio ever play on joystick? No. No, never? Nope. Now, Rio has a real meter advantage. I'd be real hard-pressed to see him use that meter this round now. Here we go with the cancels. Oh, that Jump dash cancel sucks. Cancel. And that's going to put him in. Jump kick, uh, air throw. Teleport whip. Ooh. Gets in. Now he gets spun. Gets popped up. He doesn't have enough to break. Nah, he can't break. Rio could have just x-rayed there and caught him still. The unfair advantage of the hitbox is really simple. Basically, it allows you to input multiple directions without any uh, without any human error. Um, the easiest way to describe it is it allows um, allows you to create custom macros on the fly. Um, basically, the same way as in Tekken, like you can't map um, a throw to one of the shoulder buttons. Um, you know they 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 don't allow tournaments to you know tournaments don't allow you to map two buttons uh, to a, a a shoulder button that weren't already mapped. Um, and essentially, the hitbox allows you to do that. Um, you can press and hold one button and then press another button to input two directions at once. Um, when in reality, you can't do that on a pad or a stick. It's completely impossible. Okay. Round two. Fight. I still like my D-pad. I'm a D-pad guy. I use stick. <laughs> I, I may eventually may start using stick again because I, I do feel I probably might have less problems like input errors with a stick compared to a, a D-pad. But I gotta see if I decide to go back to a stick again. Yeah, for certain games, like I, I, I like the, I like the joystick instead of the D-pad. Like Killer oh, Instinct, it's quite easy to use the joystick and D-pad. Pimp Ouija just said it. Saturn pad, the best fighting game pad ever made. Oh, I gotta admit, yeah, that was like one of the best ones. Hey, don't get me wrong, I'm, I'm coming back from Super Nintendo days. The Super Nintendo control was hot also, man. That yeah, D-pad was, was really good. That was good. So Rio ties the round the matchup so far. Fight. One, two, and he does break it. Has KT even won a match yet? I, I don't, don't think, think so. so. But he stands a good chance here. Oy. Wow. Reset? Yep, got the reset. Oh, he can't break it. Rio's going to have to really work hard here, and he is going to catch. That Pops reset is nasty in the corner. Does he break it? Yes, he does break it. Smart break right there. And that's going to do it. Yeah, he got him. He finally got him. Yeah, Rio's dropping a hitbox because he feels his unfair advantage having it, so he's gone back to using a, a controller, a, a regular PS3, PS2 controller. I think it's a PS2 controller. Yeah, it's a PS2 controller he's using. Round 
Yeah, I agree. Saturn was like one of the best ones to use out there. Oh, nice. Yeah, the, the Saturn was a great system. Absolutely. Do you still have it? Nah. I do. I don't have any of the old systems anymore. I oh my god, that. I have all my stuff. My roommate has like, every system still. He's got them buried. He never sold any single Scoot, one of them. do you have a Saturn? I had a Saturn. What'd you do with your Saturn? I sold it. Killing me. I love my Saturn. That's what you gotta do. You gotta sell that stuff. Oh, bring it over here. <laughs> what do you got? Oh, beef jerky. I, I I got I got classy Sasquatch hooked on beef jerky. Oh, there it is. You like that stuff, huh? <laughs> yeah. Now, now when uh, when he's around and playing game, he's got to be eating beef jerky. Let me try one. Small beef. You've never had beef jerky? Not this one. Mm. This has got some good flavor here. Yo, shouts out to beef jerky, man. Mm. Mm, good shit. I like it. It's not spicy. It's pretty good. What's wrong with spicy? Well, I don't like to. I don't like. Like really spicy food. I'm not Mexican, man, so I can't I can't mess with that spicy stuff. <laughs> what are you anyway? I'm Puerto Rican Italian. Oh, all right. I like my pasta and rice. Exactly. <laughs> I love my pasta. I love my rice, man. I like every other American. I love my burgers. Man, have you ever been to Five Guys Burgers and Fries? No, I've been meaning to try that, man. You know, they I got one in Long Beach. They have a few. I've seen a few out here. I saw. One, I, I keep seeing one in Queens also. They're outstanding. Yeah, here we go. Oh, you know what? We are talking about food, so I guarantee you, Juggernaut's going to show up in the chat now. Yeah, I'm getting hungry Jug too. I'm here. Eat. Neither have I. <laughs> I don't know how we got onto Five Guys Burgers and Fries for Mortal Kombat, but whatever. It started with beef jerky. I'm definitely going to try out five guys, man. You know, it's a spot, nice spot you got to go to. You got to go to Cheeseburger Cheeseburger out on Queen Boulevard. I've, I've had Cheeseburger Cheeseburger. Oh, my God. Those burgers are so yep. big. They got the one-pound challenge. I did it twice. <laughs> my brother is <laughs> also. Even my, son, my, even my own son did it. He, he's a little scrawny kid. He, he actually managed to eat the whole thing. Wow. I was surprised. We both took pictures of each other. Yep. Cheeseburger Cheeseburger is good. That's a great spot. Uh oh, oh, yeah, see, we got some people who know that. Yup. What was that? He was moonwalking, man. Did you see that? No, I didn't. He, he, looked, he was dashing for him, dashing back. Like, like it, it looked funny. That was. You saw that, right? It was it was some moonwalking stuff. Yo, Rio, let me find you, Michael Jackson, now. Let me find out you, Michael Jackson, now. Because, yeah, I saw you moonwalking now. Like, what the hell was that? It's what? That's what it was? Okay. Yes, this is real on pad. I know. Real disgusting on pad also. He spins him. Jump kick air fireball. I, I don't know about you guys, but I'm dying to see the rematch with Rio and Perfect Legend. It, it, it needs to happen. Yeah, it does. Seriously. Is it going to happen? Is, is even Perfect Legend going to NEC? I don't know. I don't think so, right? I don't know. Yeah, Warder dropped MK. He's playing UMVC3. We don't know. He might come back to MK. Who knows? Yeah, I have not spoken to Warder in a bit, so I'm not sure what the status is. Oh, I know he's playing Ultimate Marvel Capcom. Which I don't blame him. The game doesn't look bad. I was actually finally got a chance to check it out. It's not bad. It's pretty pretty insane. Stuff. I, I had fun with MVC three on a casual level, so I'm gonna get you MVC three for the same reason. Okay. I like watching it than playing it. Cause all those button presses are just too damn nuts for me. 
<laughs> it's, it's too fast, too crazy, man. All I can do is point at the flashing lights and nod. Yeah, that's about it, man. Where's the CD, brother? You guys on stream there? I know you... One of y'all gotta be watching it. CD Jr.'s on. Oh, he's on? All right. Okay, there you go. Hey, please tell me the Jets are not losing. Uh-oh. What's up, CD Jr.? I heard you weren't able to get out here, man. Hey, Phil, what happened to the jerseys? Uh, we're working on the artwork. Okay, so we're going to... Real catch him in that combo. Uh. Weppa. Wow, nice. Canceled the down four there and now dash cat into crazy. Nice spin. Monday, the first place Patriots look to stay atop the AFC East. I'm gonna hook you with some better chairs over here. You know, last week uh, during the tournament, man, my back was killing me the next day from sitting there. We'll just have to get you a different chair. Yeah, my back was destroyed. It was sore for a whole day. I was like, wow. KT Smith just he's sitting there trying to figure this matchup out, man. It's not easy. It all comes down to this. Two points, two drivers, and one. That looks so funny, that moonwalking thing he does. Yeah, hey, Rio sure does download people pretty fast. Every time I fought Rio, he makes me look like a newbie. Uh oh, here we go. No breaker, here we go. Thirty-seven. Now, now he's got breaker, so and I, he's I'll be damned if you're gonna see him use it. He's gonna take this loss before he uses a breaker. Yeah, they didn't even need to use it. Nope. Weren't you planning on taking out the smoke reset? Is it still in the game? See, what did I tell you? What did I tell you? We talked about food, and look who's in the chat now. Uh-oh. We talked about food, and Juggernaut showed up. Uh-oh. Shouts out to food and Juggernaut. Nice drop in there. Yo, no, no, I'm serious. No joke. If you ever meet Juggernaut, he's like thin as a rail. Okay? I guarantee you he weighs like 83 pounds soaking wet. Really? Like, the man eats non-stop. Non-stop. You got that good metabolism. It's my bat signal. <laughs> Yeah, smoke reset gotta go, dude. So is Cyrex reset. I'm a Cyrex player, and even I feel Cyrex reset needs to go. Round two. And shouts out to Max there. Yeah, uh, Jax needs uh, needs nerf. That's just for you, Max. There. Why is Max there on here? No, I'm just saying it in general because oh, right. we always complain about Jax. Jax needs a nerf. On the mic right now, 9.95 and Dark Natus. We are in the house. And then Scoot McGee is asking to come on to do a little commentating. So I'm going to put him on and let him commentate with Dark Natives for a little while.
Yeah, shouts out to Max. There's a uh, long paragraph on testing my. I, I love your explanations, buddy. Max is a man, man. I, I, I respect that dude. I see he's in the house. There you go. Max is in the house. That's what I'm talking about. What's up, Scoot? You gonna say anything, man? You gonna be quiet? Wait, wait, we can't hear you. Can't hear you. You gotta flip, flip this up over here. Switch up. Oh, uh, here we go. Here we there go. There we go. We got Scoot McGee on mic now. Oh my god, I see James MK playing Ultimate uh, Marvel's Capcom 3 there right now. Uh, James MK does not deserve to be playing that game. I don't know how. Uh, his name is Mortal Kombat. He should not be playing that. I don't even know if he's getting owned right now. <laughs> Phil's even commenting on him why he's playing that right now. <laughs> How old is who? Who are you asking about the age? On a scale from 1 to 10, how old are you? I don't, I don't get it. I have no idea who he's talking about. We got a lot of old farts in this place also, man. Now, Cyrus doesn't need a nerf. He just needs his bomb. His reset's taken out. I, I guess I'm a Cyrex player all of a sudden. I feel like it is ridiculous. Even though I use the damn resets, but his resets do, do need to kind of go. They need to give Cyrax invisibility. Round two, fight. Yeah, where he needs a low starter. His three three should be a low starter. I mean, for Christ's sake, come on, never round three three. It's a kick kick. You see the, the first hit. It hits low, at, like at the ankle. It's not considered as low. It's considered high. That, that's some of the retarded shit in this game. Seriously, you guys gotta fix that, man. That's crazy, right? He was human Cyrax. He has the same teleport, right? But his normal souls, especially the slower and shit. Well, his 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 teleport as human is much faster and better compared to robot. He's, it's, it comes out like instantly more. Yeah, and it's safe, right? Yeah, it's more safe. So if they fix Cyrax, uh, robot Cyrax, to the way like human Cyrax teleport is, I think we lot much more better because it's more like an instant teleport. I, I would think Max would probably agree with me on that. Oh man, you gonna do a you gonna pick up Johnny Cage, Max? Then what is going on with you, dog? I thought you picking up Striker. What happened? And CD Junior, I'm disappointing you, man. You're supposed to pick up a Shiva. You leave me alone with the Shiva or, or Shiva player over here, man. Yo, KT Smoke, man, is pretty good, man. Yeah, man, it is. It is. He was giving my Freddy a run for the money. I had to. I had to really try to figure out how to play against him. Yeah, Negative Ed messed up. So, what striker? You talking about on the max? Everything fucks striker up. Not just negative edge. <laughs> Where's Check at? Check in on the stream? I don't, I don't even see him chatting today. I'm surprised he's not watching. Yo, the shortcut inputs, man. You try to do uppercuts with Scorpion and get no. fucking Hellfire. Fight. Yo, shouts out to Input Bug and Negative Edge. Max, how many times did you get a bomb when you tried to uppercut with Striker? Look at that down one, down one. That's sick. Yeah, we're gonna get uh, Hitoshiro up eventually soon. Um, I don't even know where he at. I think he's been busy playing. He's playing Marvel. Yeah, he's playing Marvel, right? Yeah, I see him. He's playing Marvel. Oh no, he's not playing Marvel. He's over here. Yeah, it's going alright. You're supposed to be up next. Who are you fighting? I'm K James and K or something? Uh, no, Who? Where's CD Jr. at? He's in here, right? Nah, he's in the chat. Yeah, CD Jr. in the chat. Fight. You want to talk for a bit? Yeah, sure. Come on, come on. I need a break anyway. My back hurts. All right, we're going to get Hitoshiro right now. On the I'm getting off right now. Yo, what up? What up, what up? What's up, guys? How's it going? 
So yeah, I, I don't know if um, you notice, but you know how they have the two the labels up there with swords and shit, right? It doesn't look like it's from like Diablo One, like the quality and like the. I couldn't tell you because I didn't play Diablo. You never played Diablo before? All right, never mind. I, 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 I just uh, I know about it. All right. I'm not, I'm not a big RPG guy. All right. Ooh. Uh, hey. Uh. Hey. Uh. Oh, nice. Up. Oh, here we go. Filling that extra points. Bonus points. Uh. Hey. 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 Very punishable, yes, and he t takes it. What? Oh. Me and KT were talking about what that. We that? both do it. We both do desperation teleports yeah. when we're in trouble. I do desperation stuff all the time, like desperation up kick or tackle, and then I get my ass kicked anyway. I'm like, no. <laughs> Round one. Fight. Nice, goes for the air throw, jumps in, blocks the dash, does not cancel out of it. Now he's punishing it in the corner. Uh, 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 ooh, smoke bomb. Nice, for a re- oh, all right, he tries to go for the reset. Shake and bake, and is that a flawless? No, there's like a sliver of health gone right there, yeah. He blocks something. Yeah. Leo's you know, throwing that air fireball high so he can't shake it. Yeah. Baiting the shake earlier. Here we go, bonus points. Hey, hey, hey. Up, up, up. Reset. Nice. Uh, uh. Keep the pressure. Oh, that was really weird. I guess that's the whiffed air fireball, because I know Rio's using pad now. Everyone's complaining about the hitbox thing, you know, unfair advantage this or whatever, and like, it's now banned. Yeah, from what I hear, you can hold like three directions at the same time. Yeah, it's ridiculous. I was like, whoa. It's I, I mean, like, the thing is, though, like if that's banned, then keyboard should be banned. But like keyboard's not banned. And keyboard can be more precise than a hitbox, which is the weird part. But who knows? Maybe they'll ban that someday. All right, here we go. Yes, Rio is playing on a PS2 pad. Yeah, who needs a hitbox when you can play on a stick or a pad? Actually, mainly stick. Sticks are shit. I want to see Scorpion's instant air teleport on uh, Hitbox. Really? Yeah. yeah. Probably actually do it consistently on that. Nice. Nice. Eh. Ba ba ah. Uh. Ba ba ba. You doing do you doing good, KT? Keep it up. How do you commentate on Cabal? Um, it mixes you, me up when I'm not even playing. <laughs> you commentate by just making noises when he pressures, and when he gets him in the corner of the combo, you just go A, 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 and that's really it. And just go <laughs> when he shoots fireballs. Fire. I'm just, I told Phil I'd jump on here for him so he can go get something to eat. Yeah. I'm the worst. Nice. Well, season breaker. It's near fireballs. Gets hit with a smoke bomb. Now here comes the punishment combo. Now he uh, just dash, you know, teleport punches in to keep the pressure. Now Rio with his own pressure. KT gets out of it. Ooh. Nice. Nice mix. I think that was an input glitch right there. I'm sure he tried to down one. Maybe. But that was some nice pressure by uh, Rio. Oh, nice low. Oh. Uh, oh. He goes for the throw. Wait, rating? Nice. Wait, what's going on in the uh, in this thread? Are they talking about like a patch or a pop fix or some shit? Uh, they were saying something about Raiden. Raiden getting his uh, fucked over. Nerds. Aw, oh, man. I like Raiden, though. Whatever. Any changes based on online play would be retarded. Yeah. Like, fix uh, Reptile's block infinite that's only online. Yeah, Reptile, because Reptile always had a block infinite.
Round one. Fight. Who would you say is the top player? Top top character in online. Online? I don't know, I don't yeah, play with, online. With lag. With lag? Yeah. Probably noob, because you won't be able to jump from shadows on well, time. Yeah, the new noob side by. Yeah, yeah, the new, exactly. The new noob side by is probably crazy. But, like, honestly, online, I could see noob, yeah, I could reptile. see reptile, reptile really definitely. Um, I, 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 could, I could confirm that, because I played reptile online. It's fucking ridiculous. Other than that, ridiculous. I don't know, like... Oh yeah, no, Shiva and Kano definitely. Kano is annoying with lag. Like, you can't get out of anything. You know who else? Melina's really good online. What is screen... Oh. Screen saver, right? Screen saver, there you go. There we go. What, what's so good about Scorpion online? What's, what's he got? Fire. Well, I guess the Hellfire. You can't jump out of it in time. Hellfire does like fucking no damage. His Hellfire. It stacks, man. I don't know. People probably have. Yeah, I would think Scorpion sucks online too. I don't. You know. Maybe it's 50-50 is harder to block. I don't know. Done the EX, you would have chipped in the death. Very close for KT. Thought he was going to get him before the forward four recovery was over, but turns out. Oh, uh, Quake 3 is. Dude, Quake 2? The Quake series was godlike before 4. 4 was a. Where there is smoke, there's fire. But yeah, we got uh, we got like three uh, Mortal Kombat setups. We got a bunch of UMVC three setups set up here because everyone brought their own systems for it today. And uh, I'm seeing some crazy Dante shit. Nobody wants to play AE with me. I don't like Street Fighter like four. Like I'd play it, but I don't know. I'm just fuck it. I'll play Super t like you know Super Turbo. Like I'll bust around in that, hey, but I'm I'll, not good. I'll play Super Turbo with you. Don't threaten me with a good time. Nah, no HD remix. No, no fake fireballs here. Yeah, <laughs> those those fireball cancels are awesome though. It's like great pressure. Up. Oh. I'm focusing on Mortal Kombat and Virgil at the same time. I'm just like, ooh, I want to see what he's doing. Fight. <laughs> James MK is playing Ultimate Marvel and just button mashing. I'm loving it right now. I hate on Street Fighter 4, but I still like it. Yeah. I'd rather play 4 than 3. 3, I don't really... I like Third Strike too. I like Street Fighter in general. I play all that shit. I like Third Strike casually, but like competitively, I'm just like, yo, no. <laughs> no way. No, no. Wait, who broke a stick, Max? Wait, who broke a stick? CD Jr. broke a stick? CD Jr., did you rage? CD Jr. didn't break a stick. Come on. <laughs> Come on. Where there is smoke, there is fuck. Round one. Fight. Now, ST, ST shits on HD Remix. AC right. remixes Ryu and Zangies. At um, BSM tonight, we got myself, Hitashura, we got uh, Scoot McGee over here, Dark Natus, Ryo and KT Smith are playing. We have Scott McGizzle. <laughs> For Elise, we got uh, Revolver. James MK is attempting to play Marvel vs. Capcom 3 Ultimate, and he's getting his ass kicked. Um, 
We have uh, Classy Sasquatch somewhere lingering. And a bunch of other Marvel players that are here tonight. Uh, fortunately, the CD Bro's going to make it out tonight. And, uh, yeah. Dark Rob, I think. Didn't Dark Rob quit? Uh, apparently, yeah. He played, he played in the tournament on Saturday. He was just for shits and giggles because it's casual. But, like, uh, yeah, he, he quit, which is... Huh. I'm not putting on tag matches, nor will I ever put on any tag matches. That is not... No, I, I say no point on the tag match. If it fills up for it, go right ahead. But I will not personally put up tag matches. Unless it's tag tag, tag and tag tournament too. That's what's up. So who's, who's getting on next? I, I haven't played Rio in months, man. I want to play Rio too. Last time I played Rio was when uh, we had that little TV chick going. Remember we were doing three on three yeah. or whatever? That was the last time I played it. Oh. And he goes for the trollish x ray. Alright. Hopefully, when Phil gets back, we get some more players on this soon. Because, I don't know, I think maybe they're seen, sick and tired of seeing uh, Rio and KT play for, like, ever. Well, what do you guys say? Who do you want to see on stream next? Round one. Fight. Someone. All right. Very blunt, but he's honest. He's not going to play Liu Kang. Huh? All right. They want to see Max the first CD Jr. Let's get the stream from that crib. I don't know. How many viewers do you got? 135. So we got a couple of nuke side bots. Alright. Alright. You know what? You wanna go up next? Round two. Fight. What, me? Yeah, me and you. I'll play A. Listen, I'll, I'll never turn down a uh, game. Alright. Like I said, don't threaten me with a good time. Alright. I'm just warning you guys, I've been playing Ultimate Marvel for the past like six days, so I'm gonna be, uh. Yeah. Uh, get out of here with these excuses. I just, so shut the fuck up. Nah. I'll warn them quick though, but. I did something, found something nice today, I wanna see if I can try it out on you. I don't know shit about the ball of smoke, so. It is true, it's like riding a bike, you fall off it and you get hurt. Who's picking Baraka? Who plays Baraka? James MK, right? Yeah. The only Baraka. Shadow uh, Zero Kayo also plays uh, Baraka. He's got a very nice Baraka. Shout out to him. Shout out to THTV. His Baraka is lol. <laughs> Damn. Alright guys, we're going to get uh, one more and then me and Scooter are going to go up because everyone's sick and tired of seeing you play. They'll all get the fuck off. <laughs> they love you though. No, they're not sick of it. What? What? No, cause uh, is it a fan? Not yet. But you're you're playing on pad because it's gonna get banned. Oh. All right. All right. If Storms is anywhere in this chat, um. Rio didn't quit playing Hitbox. His Hitbox broke. So that's why he's been using Pad. By the time it gets fixed, though, there's no point because it's going to get banned in tournaments no. anyway. So, like, Fight. sucks for Snook. Sunk. Not Snook. Sunk and uh, all those other Hitbox players out there. Hey, I got a CRT over here that I brought here. We could play MK9 on that shit. Yeah, no, dude. Like, the, the, the Hitboxes, the ones that are dual modded, they always break so easily, apparently. Like... I wish you'd be playing a CRT. MK9 oh, is so nice on CRT. Wait, ECT, ECT, we had like four. CRT That's right, setups. yeah, ECT, we had a nice uh, CRT setups. One of them was really like, bad though, but other than that, it was great. I just asked Rio, and Rio told me that his broke, he didn't quit. He just hit broke, and he's not getting it fixed. Well, apparently not getting it fixed. He's using pad at the moment. Round two. Fight. I mean, Phil's not here. Where do you go? He went to get food, right? 
Yeah, he said he wanted to get some of Yeah. I got class tomorrow. This sucks. I got a whole lot to do. We have one CRT set up here at VSM. Thanks to Scoot. Uh, but that will be for the PS2 when I get a Guilty Gear crowd here. That'd be great. <laughs> And that's just for me. Or any other PS2 or Killer Instinct, whatever wants to be playing on there. Alright, let's go. Uh, let's see, you gotta change these names. Uh, we're getting on. Oh, uh, yeah, I don't know how to do that, so I'll leave that to you. Oh, they can't get it. It's a different program. Oh, uh, how do you change it? Who's getting on? Me and you? Yeah. Him, you want to get up on the mic? Oh, okay, okay. Alright. They're going to play until Phil gets back, so, because we don't know how to work this new program, so, yeah. Listen, I'll just be Rio and you be KT. Nah. Oh, all right, I'll be KT then. You be Rio. <laughs> they know. They know who we are. Come on. For now, um, we'll get James on K and Nita. You want to go on there? Hold on a second. KT, you want to keep playing? You can go ahead until Phil gets back. If you want to keep playing, you can play until Phil gets back. Yeah. All right. Uh, Rio, take the mic. I'm going to go play some more Marvel. Here. Alright guys, we have a technical difficulty on the name, so right now it says KT Smith and Rio, but actually I'm not playing, it's actually KT Smith against James MK. Phil isn't here, so we can't change the names. Oh yeah, and I also, I heard apparently there's an article on TYM saying I quit Hitbox. I didn't, I didn't necessarily quit Hitbox. My hitbox broke again, so I don't feel like sending it in again and then waiting another month just to get another one back. I don't want to have to do that every, you know, every other month. What's what's going on with the hitbox? It like, just it malfunctioned again and stopped working. So I have to constantly send. This is the second time it's happened. First time I didn't mind. I was like, okay, whatever. I was, you know, not that lucky. But it happened it's again smoke. next month, and I'm like, okay, I don't want to have to do this every other month and then you know waste time. Yeah, 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 yeah. I, I can see that being annoying. I used to go through that problem with my Xbox. Yeah, and you know, I've been I've been using pad right now, and honestly, I'm kind of comfortable with it. I don't mind playing on pad, but I'm just saying, like, for people who are asking why I'm not using Hitbox anymore, it's because it broke. So I don't know 
anything about Baraka. What did he get uh, in the new patches? I know he got uh, 4-2 as an overhead in this patch. Yeah. His spin comes out 7 frames now and it's safe on block. But it doesn't really matter much because you can just duck it. That move right there is better too, right? The uh, dash move. Yeah, and yeah, the, the enhanced version goes full screen. The back one into 2-4 for Cabal's combo, it just takes practice. There's nothing more to it. What I realize is everything I could do on hitbox, I can do on pad. Which is weird because I haven't really been practicing on pad with Cabal. It just kind of like transitioned from the way I thought of playing on hitbox. Like, you know, how you have that mindset, how you know how to do things. Yeah. When I went to pad, I just, it kind of just flowed, you know. I didn't really have to act. Yeah, it felt the same. Yeah. You don't really need a hitbox for this game or anything. You can just play on whatever. Yeah, really. It's not, you know, it puts everything out really hard. You play on RT stick, play on controller. Yeah, it's not really that difficult, you know, to do moves in this game, so... I, I was actually able to play on pad. I was playing on pad uh, like a couple weeks ago at my, at my friend's house. I didn't have sticks on it or whatever. We were playing Mortal Kombat. You know, the, on, the only thing I'll say I like a lot about pad is you don't have to carry a big ass, you know, yeah. box with you. Exactly. You can just put it in your pocket. It's very convenient. The only reason I play on stick is because of Street Fighter. Like, so I started playing on stick from that. But, uh, you know, I honestly feel like I should switch the pad for Mortal Kombat. Like, it's better. In my opinion, I just think it's better because one, they can't hear you pressing buttons, so you have that silence factor. Exactly. Two, it's very easy to carry, and that's about it. Oh, the the uh, the smacking of the buttons on the uh, especially with Scorpion, one. they know you go one 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 one. You know they yeah yeah. Do it. They know when to end up. Yeah. Why is Maxter quitting MK if they patch the Thomas two one? Who said Katana's 2-1 was even being patched? It hasn't been confirmed by Apollo or anyone, has it? Yeah, that was due to negative edge. I wasn't trying to do fireball that much. Okay, so we have Phil back, and he's going to be fixing the names real quick to James MK and Katie Smith. I don't I don't think they're patching Katana's 2-1. Hey guys, sorry about that. I was starving, so I had to go get something to eat or I was just gonna like die. Waste away to fat. Um, so sorry about that and now that the names are updated, how long have they been playing? Uh they they just started. Okay, that's good. What did they play like one or two matches? Smoke. Jax, I would say yeah, three or two. What's I going would on say Simon? Jax is a really good character. Tournament viable.
the only four characters that uh, that are apparently being uh, messed with in the hotfix are Jax, Cabal, Katana, and I'm forgetting the fourth. Cyrax, I think. Those four characters. Actually, K7, I probably will. You know why? Because... Have they guaranteed that he's going to be nerfed? Cabal? Yeah. Well, nothing is guaranteed. It's just all rumor right now, but... I would say he's definitely going to be... If they do release a hotfix, he's definitely going to be one of the characters. I've actually been realizing uh, the more I play Cabal, the more I realize his fireballs aren't as good. If you play against someone who has a matchup experience, so I've been playing Cabal lately a lot with, without much use of fireballs. Yeah, I noticed you weren't using your instant air gas balls a lot today. Yeah, I like to, like with Cabal now, I like to space more and I like to focus more on rushdown. Uh, do, does, does his, do his cancels still work the same? Is it going to work the same? Do they still work the same? Oh, yeah, they do. I mean, they did add a little bit of delay to back two and four, but that's because it was stupid, like... They were back to repeat spin was pretty much like a block infinite mid screen. Okay. And then four repeat spin dash cancel was uh it was like a wall infinite some characters on the wall. So you know they had to remove that. It was too okay. Stupid. Yeah. But yeah, I'm saying like Cabal. I don't think Cabal could just win on doing instant air fireballs unless you're up against like a character like new that has no way to deal with it. But otherwise, you're gonna have to learn how to play play Cabal up close. I've been just focusing on playing Cabal with his enhanced spin more. You know, I, I gotta tell you, watching watching James MK play, he's gotten a lot better with Ken Wow. Yeah, he has. He really, he's competing with the, some of the better players here. You know, and for a while... He always he, told me Kung Lao was his favorite character. That's why I told him, like, you should just play Kung Lao more instead of Baraka. Wow, you see what Paco Polo said here? CRTs are the same, you know, they're old tube TV, TVs, you know, but if, if you're using um, a 2MS, a good 2MS monitor, like the Asus or anything made by Acer or LG, um, you really, I mean, you're talking 2MS, that drops one frame every two minutes. And I highly doubt that that one frame in every two minutes is going to make that much of a difference. Um, Unless you're playing a game that constantly requires just frame inputs. Right. Well, yeah, but, like, I could see that maybe happening in, like, Virtual Fighter where, you know, some of the stuff I was showing you. Yeah, you need, like, just frame timing on just about everything you do. Right. I think the only just frame in this game is when you do Kung Lao's 2-4 and it hits him, and then you do 2-4, 1 plus 3, and then you got to time the 2 perfectly. You know when he does that palm and he hits you back? Uh, yeah. That's like a just frame. Yep. I think it is, unless there's like a two or three frame. What's up, Max? I think it is. I'm not sure. It might be like a two. It might have a window of two or three frames. It could be one. But you could just, you don't have to time perfectly, you could just mash two, and then hope that you happen to land on the frame where you're supposed to press it, and it'll work that way, which I see a lot of people do instead of actually going for the timing. I have no idea if they're touching the gas blast or anything. I I don't know anything about if, if there's even a hotfix coming out. So what do you think, Rio? Do you think we're going to be able to get those eight players for uh, MKDC at NEC? Yeah. 
You think Maybe so? Maybe more. Yeah. All right. I think there will be more than 8 players for every MK game there. MK2, MK3, MKDC, MK9. Because when I go, I just enter any MK game regardless. And I'm sure there are a lot of people that also do that, so... Well, see, and, and Polo, that's one of the things, is that, you know... Um, a lot of today's fighting games are made for 16-9. They're not made for 4-3, so it changes, uh, you know, changes the game at 4-3. I say take anything Tom says with a, with a grain of salt. Unless he actually shows you proof that they confirm that they're going to change Cabal's air fireball, then I wouldn't look too into it, you know? You don't even have to take it with a grain of salt, you can just take it with a cup of salt. If he gets the reset. Combo. Oh, I think he got an That's input. He do. went to do down four. He got a standing four. And I could have sworn Jimmy had that uh, had that match wrapped up too. Yeah, he was gonna walk up and do a four. No, I think he was gonna try and do a dash and do a down four, but he got forward four instead. Hey, Rio, Stor uh, Storm says to check your PMs. All right, I'm what? Probably test your might. Okay. Oh, yeah, and also congratulations to test your might uh, and also to Classic MK. Um, the two sites merged today, so congrats to both sites. Did they? And, yeah, and, uh, and welcome to all the Classic MK members on test your might. Oh, so that's what the maintenance for, was yes. for. Oh, okay. Pretty cool. I think the only character that can fight Jax up close is probably Katana. Because Jax has to get through her range. And getting through Katana's range is pretty hard. Like, if you're forced to go to Katana, that's really difficult to do. Yeah, I think I think Katana is like a good match for Jax. If you like, if you're having trouble with Jax, you should like look into Katana. Yeah, Katana and 16-bit did play. I mean, wow, Katana. Tom Brady and 16-bit did play. Polo, thanks for being on the stream, bro. I appreciate it. Good seeing you, and we'll definitely talk to you soon. Like I said, get in touch with me, and we'll play some MKAK when the patch comes out. Yeah, Polo, later.
But they did play. I don't know if it was 45 minutes, but they did play for a while. Sindel. Kano. Yeah, they played way. They played for way more than six matches. No, I, I cannot ban Maxter. You know what, I think Sindel would be so. Uh, I think Sindel would be a lot better if they made her hair whip a mid and they made her car wheel safe on block. Wow, you, you know. The she has like no armor, no defense at all. The, 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 the CD brothers are, are arguing in the stream chat right now. I think it was like 40 to 10 around there. I saw a lot of katana winking that day, so. What were you saying uh, just now? I was saying the CD brothers are, are arguing in the stream <laughs> about whatever. I think during that day I told Tom to quit sub zero. And then he didn't talk to me for the rest of the day, so I don't know. I don't know what was going through his head. And Dark Natus is making his uh, his exit for the night. Actually, MKDC is a little bit similar to MK9. The movement is like a little bit similar. And some of the motions for, you know, the motions for attacks are a little bit similar. But that's about it. I still think the best MK game is Trilogy. And you already know why. Yes, I know why you think Trilogy is the best. Why? Because it's the fastest. No, it's well, not no, the fastest. Well, no, MK4, MK Gold is. Because it's, it's so balanced. Pimp Ouija, uh, Rio likes the, the N64 trilogy. I didn't like the PlayStation 1 because two reasons. One, it took forever to load when you chose a map or whatever. Two, the bosses were playable. I used to play with my brother way back and he would always choose the fucking bosses just to piss me off. What's up, Max? I think Raiden should have kept some advantage on his uh, vicinity blast, but, you know, just reduce it to, like, plus five. Don't make it 
plus 10 or whatever. Max, I already asked them about that. They said that I have to call them about it next week. It really depends. Um, it depends upon how much they get done over the weekend. I think it's possible for anyone to do instant air fireballs with Cabal, no matter what you use. So have I told you about the hitbox and keyboard thing that if they decide to ban both of them then like they might look into also banning controllers with analog. Really? Yeah. Why? You know why? Because look, <clears throat> let's say the example I gave to you, right? You can hold up on a keyboard or hitbox and then right. just tap back, back. Well, on like... Uh, a controller with an analog, you could... Do the same thing. Yeah, you could hold up on an analog and then press back, back, you know, do the same exact crap. So how would you, like... How would you view that as you're, like, seeing as that being banned also with hitbox and keyboard? I, I, I think it's a little bit more difficult to do with the... It is, but, I mean, with practice, you could, you know, be yeah, able to I do guess, it. but... Um, by the way, uh, insufferable, probably at Roosevelt. So that that would only kind of leave stick, right? As what to play on, just stick. Nothing else would be, unless you use a PS1 pad with no analog. Or you get a PS2 pad and rip the analogs off. Or that. So I think Scoot McGee and Rio are gonna get in next. Actually, you can. You can do that on analog. You just have to... It's, it's obviously going to take a little bit more training to do, but you can... If someone was dedicated enough, they would be able to do it. You could look. You could have your left hand. You could have your thumb on the analog holding up, and then you could press with your finger to do that. And you don't have to do anything different with your right hand. That's just one example. I'm sure there's, you know, more effective ways in doing it. Later, Simon. Kano, Sindel. I think these guys are just going all random here. Yeah, they have been for the <laughs> last couple of matches. Shows you just how much I've been paying attention. Yeah. I think I don't think it would matter if you were to learn that or not to win. I think anyone could win or not. It just depends on the player more than what you can do. Hey, Shadow Zero, how come you haven't been here? Yeah, we're missing a lot of people today. Yeah, didn't have any of the CD brothers, Not no, no Ryu48, no Dark Rob. Yeah, a lot of people. Yeah, I will be using pad because there's no way my hitbox is going to be fixed before any C. Hey, 
Max, are you still playing Warcraft? Atta boy, that's what I like to hear. You know what, Maxer, Maxer does have a point though. He said he quit spending hours trying to find new tech because they will get nerfed. If you think about it, a lot of stuff has been nerfed that way. Like um, people that have to... Maxer only plays World of Warcraft on Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday though. Wow, no MK at all? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> nice. Maybe against Tom in a mirror match. But only if there's MK1 costume. Yes, Captain Execution. I do play World of Warcraft. Kano wins. Actually, people in... What is it? Uh, South America? Yeah, they do play MK4. At a high level. You could actually type in YouTube. Type in MKK MK4... And hit enter, and you will see a lot of high-level matches of MK4. The game is incredibly fast, and it looks really fun. It's Hanzo and a bunch of people from from Venezuela that play the game. I think the input bug happens more if you have a Guido haircut. Watch Jersey Shore. A Guido haircut? Yeah. And play alternate outfits. Also... I've noticed the more you think of the input bug happening, the more it will happen. So if you don't think it'll happen, it won't really happen as much, from my experience. Max, are you serious? People were crying that hunters were overpowered? I mean, were, were too weak? Yo, everywhere Maxer goes, there's no matter what game it is, there's always a group of people crying about something that isn't right, and then what, whatever's being crying about gets buffed. Yeah, I, I know, I know what BM was. Since we're on the topic of nerfing and buffing, I still think the two characters that were treated the most unfair in this game are definitely Jade and Scarlet. They were good, solid characters until people bitched or, well, not necessarily bitched, well, for Scarlet, kind of, but they made them seem overrated in a sense that they got them nerfed. You know, with Jade losing her up three because people said it was bullshit and whatever. And with Scarlet with her knives and everything, those characters were nerfed for no reason. They were beatable when they had all their tools.
Because I know there were some matchups where Jay could just win with up three alone, and I guess, you know, I don't know. I mean, with Scarlet, you could just you could just win Kunai all day, some matchups, and Jade, you could just up three, and I guess, you know, some people didn't, didn't like that. They don't like one just one tool. You can just win a matchup with one tool, so I guess they nerf it or whatever. Yeah, I agree. Up three was fine the way it was. It, it was honestly what Jade was... Her whole game was revolved around her old up three. And when they took it away because people were saying it was, you know, bullshit that Jade could just up three you all day, I don't think that was reasonable at all. Same thing with Scarlet. So guys, the next match. So the next match is actually going to be, uh, we're going to have Scoot McGee versus Hiroshura. Scorpion. He's scorpion against Noob. Noob. What do you think about that match? Could be 5-5, five, five, Scorpion has meter. Without meter, probably Noob has a slight advantage. Well, I think, I think the tough part for that match is going to be uh, Scorpion trying to get in on Noob. Yeah, I know. But if he doesn't have meter, then you could... I mean, if he has meter, you can um, reaction punish the tackles with True. a full combo. True. Well, you can also... Uh, yeah, I mean, with meter, he can, uh, he can just do the uh, enhanced uh, spear. Yeah, that, that's what I'm saying. Otherwise, he has to be risky and do a, you know, a teleport. That should be your next character. You should learn Sector. I tried Sector for like a few days. How'd you like him? But he was okay, in my opinion, but... Yeah, he was good. I just I didn't like how when you get knocked down with him, you're pretty much free. Wow. I don't know. I mean, we're going to have a... Are we doing that uh, thing next week where we're going to play MK with on the first version, 1.0? I don't know yet, because I don't even know if we're going to be back here next week or if we're going to have the week off. Okay, well, apparently Tom Brady's moving back to New Jersey in, a, in whatever, like in a few days. He'll be here by that VSM. So on that day, if, if we have VSM up next week, we'll play on that version and they could do... Point one zero jacks versus point point zero sub zero, and see what happens. What do you think's gonna win that? I don't know. <laughs> <sighs> All right. So up next, Hitoshura and Scoot McGee. Block, block infinites will be loud. It'll be everything goes.
fight! Rio, you're really looking forward to this uh, vanilla MK9 tournament, huh? Yeah, I do. I, I want to play it. It may have to be on uh, 360, just so you are aware. I know. I have converters anyway, so... I just want to see how the old character is going to hold up. You know, people using their character now. People who main a character now, how they're going to hold up in the old version. They can compete then. You know, there were never really any needs for patches, you know? True. Do you see the the trolling that Max and CD Jr. are doing to each other? Wow. I like how he said factory. Like Jax went into a factory and they repaired his arms and gave him more <laughs> metal and robot. <laughs> he feels happy CD Senior 16-0 you. Yo, know, these guys are gonna come in, in a week and a half. These guys are gonna come with black eyes. They come with blood. I'm saying, yo, I'll tell you right now. NEC, CD Junior versus Maxter, and CD Junior versus Crazy Dominican, and Crazy Dominican versus Maxter money matches. What do you think? With side possibly, bets. possibly gonna happen. With side bets. Money match them at um, NEC. Or next week on stream if we have VSM. No, I think it's just you because there is sound. Oh, wait, Maxer has uh, backup now. He said he's going to bring out Jax and mirror him in a money match. I've never seen Maxer's Jax, so I don't know what's going to happen. Guys, you all have, sa uh, have uh, sound, right? That was a really nice anti air combo.
I already have my bet placed on who I think is going to win. You know, all I have to do, I just want to do screen cap. I just stream the CD Juniors and Maxter's argument. Just stream that. I actually find this very entertaining. I'm, I'm enthralled by it. I'm not even commentating. It's not good. <laughs> They're not here, and yet they still entertain us. Yeah. <laughs> Wow, wow, Scorpion just got completely knocked off screen with that. You mean Scorpion? I know, I know, Max. See now, Scoot taking advantage of what Noob has to do here. If Noob can't just sit back or he's going to eat some uh, Hellfire. Scoot wins that air to air. I see if you timed that better, he would have won that match. Round three, fight. Because I think Scorpion gets forty percent off the enhanced spear. Good up kick by uh, by uh, Peter Shura. Teleport, jump over. Now he's gonna start over. Can't count either of them out right now. That's gonna be a lot of damage for Scorpion. He's gonna break. He's gotta break it, yep. Alright, now. Good nice break. break. Good Noob has to yeah. watch out. You can't, you can't eat a jump punch by Scorpion at this point. No, then it's gonna be over. Uh, you gotta, you gotta, he has meter, so you're gonna have to watch out for the spear. Yeah, and Scorpion uh, can't get caught. If you throw it at the wrong time and he gets it, the match is over. Yeah. Uh, Scorpion can't get caught in the corner either right now. Now, you see now Scorpion's turtling from Noob. Oh, you and that's see, gonna there be it, is. it. He was looking for that. Yeah, he was waiting for that. Wins. There's not much Noob can do full screen aside from that when someone has a meter and you have low health. You kind of have to accept the fate. KT Smith getting out of here for the night. Great seeing you, brother. So that Hellfire is guaranteed if you don't do a wake-up attack. Oh, a big wall yeah, combo. Yeah, big, huge wall combo. Enhanced air throw into the jump kick air throw. Wow. 47% out of Scorpion. I got to talk to Scoot to show me how to do that. If you have Just because bar. I want to say it was that I, I, I could do it. <laughs> Scoot just not letting him sit back and throw. He's using that uh, that Hellfire the right way. That's gonna do he's he's using he it sparingly because he doesn't want to you know, become predictable with it. You know, I don't, now I don't this, know if those are input is, errors or whatever, but... This is what a lot of the people who were complaining about knew uh, had a problem with. Yep. Corner combo, nope, he misses. Wasn't quite close enough to get it. This could be the only time Noob is very dangerous is when he has you in the corner and he hits you. Kind of like that. 
Yeah, he does. He does really good damage in the corner. Yeah, now uh, Scoop has a serious meter advantage, and that's dangerous with Scorpion. I think Katana's 2-1 is one of Punisher, the best normals yep, in the game. And he breaks it. If you were to ask me, I think it's one of the best normals in the game. 2-1, really, really good. Throw him. Does not put it back in the corner, though, surprisingly. And here we come with the barrage of uh, of shadows, but a good day, good break by her, uh, by... Hitoshura. And got him in the corner. Oh, he oh and he dropped the combo. Match would have been over. Yeah, that would have been it. Now the positions are reversed. Yep. And, and he can do a lot of damage. Not quite sure oh, wow. where that enhanced came from. I think he meant to do the up shadow, but yeah. when he jumped over, he reversed his control, so he did the forward tackle by accident. Wow, and I think... That cost I him think the match. Yep. Yeah. He had that match uh, won on the first round. He yeah, just, well, that was a combo. good. Yeah, that was a good jump over by Scoot. Then it was. He tried to, uh, you know, reverse his controls, and it worked. Round one. Fight. Scootin's basically sniffing out that jump, uh, that, that jump kick or jump punch, whichever one. Oh, portal to use. reset! Almost hit it. Almost got him. And well, every one of these matches have been in the same corner. <laughs> I think he don't need to grab a little bit more. Yeah, I think That's so. Reverse positions. Yeah, this is, a, this is a really tough. This is a really bad spot for Noob. Because at this range, when Noob decides to throw a tackle, Scorpion can jump over you and then combo you, and then you're stuck wow, in the corner with a really vortex. really good. Oh, uh, 4-4 four, four hit confirm into his spear. Grab into the corner. This is Scoot's favorite spot. And there's that uh, whiff air uh, air teleport. Yep, that another I was throw. And I think that yeah, see, did you know what's up? I think that Scoot, I mean, not Scoot. I think that Hito Shore kind of mailed it in on that round. He's looking pretty frustrated, actually, because... Well, you know, I no, mean... No, I could see, like, he had some matches won. He just, he yeah. messed up. He, he's been playing uh, UMVC3 right now, so... Uh, I would say Jax is right, a bit right under the top tier characters. For at least the same enough to get the images. I don't know what images are. I won't forget, don't worry. See now, you gotta, you know, by watching this you can see Scoot is basically training him. Um, Basically training him to zone and then using that as, an ability, as the right time to hit him with uh, an enhanced spear. And then when he's doing that, when he's not doing that, uh, he's training him to zone and then training to to jump by trying to uh, anti-zone him with the hellfire and baits that into a down one and the air into a teleport. Yeah, that's pretty much what he's been doing. And it's been working so far. So I yeah, mean, so far you don't really have to change up if you're doing something that's working.
That's all. Uh, the jump punch didn't connect. That would have been a really big combo. Yes, sir. Possibly ending the round, but now the positions are reversed yep. again. Noob is in the corner. Nice yeah, uppercut. That's not where he wants Back to in be. the corner. And now Noob has a guess. Is he, is he going to jump over or is he going to, you know, stand there? And he gets baited. Every time he has that one bar meter with Noob, you can't really throw something because then, you know, the round will end. And yeah, he baited that. It was a 50 it was a 50 50 either sit there take the hellfire or do a wake up yeah and he chose he just guessed wrong Round one. Fight. Does he, oh, and he teleports Probably out a little of the too late on that. Yeah. Sit using that, and he gets him with that twice every time. See, and he oh, tried to beat him one, into that. That one gets the air teleport. Yep. Oh, nice jump anticipation. Spear. Yep, jump over. Swords, teleport. Jump over again into a throw. Kind of resets the situation into a hellfire. All right, now Scorpion does have two meters to burn, so, yeah, and there's one of them, right and now right he's going to force a breaker, yep. or not, he might, he may take the damage, I wouldn't go with taking the damage, because you're not gaining any meter. And it seems Hito's forfeiting. Okay, so do you want to jump in against uh, against Scoot? Yeah, I'll jump on. All right. So I guess you're going to be player one. Round two, fight! 
There's game commentary, guys. Sorry. I've just been, uh, <clears throat> had to take care of a couple of administrative things for a second. So we got James MK for one of the first times ever going to jump on commentary with us. Go ahead. You're good. What's going on there, Jimmy? Not much, not much. Just watching a uh, little Rio in uh, scoot matches here. Nice, nice. You can actually watch on the screen here if you want it. They run identical. James they MK. Talk about MK1. <laughs> uh, what do we want to know about MK1? Shout out to uh, Shadow Zero out there. He hasn't been here in weeks. No. Shadow Zero, you got to get your ass over here. Need some more Barakas. Oh, that burp tasted like beef jerky. I could taste it over here. Nice. Was it good? No, not at all. In my opinion, I think uh, Scoot's probably one of the uh, best scorpions out there. Yeah, I think so. These guys have been trolling each other all night tonight. Wow, he just baited that uh, that jump into a down one teleport into punish. That was really good. Pip's asking uh, the best revision of uh, MK1 uh, would probably be the 2.0 version where they, uh, they turned the gravity and left the gravity off so you can actually have infinite combos. And CD Jr. out there uh, want Max to, to be banned from streams. <laughs> Hey, listen, I wasn't keeping him hidden. He, uh, uh, he just likes to play. He didn't want to come on stream until today. Jimmy, they're loving whatever accent, apparently, that you've got. I have an accent? I don't know. Do you? <laughs> I guess I got an accent. It's a New York thing. I'm going to have to tweet this out at them. No, James MK on, uh, on, on.